wow it's really bright that's all I have to say um hello my trans youth followers how are you please ignore <laughs> the mess going on in the background okay I don't know what's going on with that uh, okay okay um basically I'm gonna stop in and do another video because it's Thursday which means it's my day which means um I'm not really sure what that means but it's another day for my opinion and my opinion always is a little yeah <laughs> um what was I gonna say oh yeah this week's topic is about confidence and basically meaning are you confident because you transitioned are you confident for being transgender and I, I don't know, this is a really weird one for me to answer, um, because, like, after watching the other girls' videos, um, it's kind of, for me, like, my opinion is much like the other girls. Um, I personally think that for going through transition you are extremely confident it takes a lot of courage it takes a lot of confidence and it takes a lot of gusto um, I mean you have to I mean not saying you will because a lot of it is internal but dealing with that internal conflict of what other people think of you it takes a lot of courage and also you know, what other people may view transgenderism um, could really be negative. So that takes a lot of confidence to kind of deal with that, as well as educating people around you, because um, it can be really uncomfortable to do those things, and it's completely understandable, you know? Um, I know personally I don't like to deal with conflict, so, you know, because I find if I deal with conflict, I just get really angry. <laughs> so I just end up being like, none of that bitches. Mm -mm. Um, so, I don't know. I mean, you can't fight fire with fire, right? So I just avoid it at all costs. Um, maybe it's because I'm angry. I don't know. I'm drinking from my really cool lioness mug. I don't know if you can see it. It's super dorky and I love it. It's my cup of coffee for the day. It's probably why I'm so hyper. Um, back to the topic. <laughs> Basically, for me personally, I don't feel like I, I have a lot of confidence. Um, especially with... Now, I'm going to take it back. I'm, I am a really confident person. Um, but when in regards to my transition... I am not a confident person at all. Like, I am always so worried about what everyone else thinks. If anyone stares at me for longer than two seconds, I'm like, that bitch is clocking me. And I'm like, fuck, what am I going to do? You know? And um, I don't feel like I'm confident because it has been a pressing issue that I've known about for an extremely long time. But it didn't take me until about a year ago for me to do anything about it and it was pretty much exactly a year ago this month that I decided that it has to be done and um, you know after battling that for what 14 years yeah 14 years jeez after battling that for 14 years um, you know it took me 14 years to suck it up and be like bitch you need to do what you need to do um, yeah, so I don't really think I'm that confident. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm very extroverted, but I don't think that should be mixed up with confidence, um, because I'm constantly worried about making, not only just what other people think, but making people uncomfortable, um, if someone 
around me doesn't really know about the idea or isn't really um, doesn't really agree with it not that I necessarily care but you know I just don't want to make that person uncomfortable um, because I just want to respect everyone's views and opinions and if they want to view transsexuals in some sort of negative weird light that's absolutely fine um, that's on them I'm not saying it's a negative issue at all I'm just saying that if they want to think that way I am not going to sit there and try and change their minds because I'm not in the business of fixing anybody <laughs> um, you know so yeah I guess that's kind of my opinion on it, I'm sure. Um, it takes a lot of courage to go through this process, and I really think that I'm still battling with the whole confidence thing. Um, you know, things like facial hair and, um, you know, my features. Like, I just find sometimes I look so manly and at the end of the day when I have to take, up my, take off my makeup I'm like I can't even be bothered to look at myself I avoid mirrors at all costs um but yeah I think that answers the question we're gonna go with that <laughs> it takes confidence um to transition but I don't think I am personally that confident of an individual. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. Because, um, you know, it'll be interesting to see what you guys have to hear. Um, oh yeah, in regards to a video I made, not last week, but the week before, I had a user made a <laughs> make a comment about the fact that you know going through transition you're lying to yourself and that it doesn't work and I'm sorry but I, I can't speak for everyone here but it came down to a point for me where it was a do or die situation and living this way makes me happy I'm sorry it didn't work out for you but you shouldn't have to inflict your opinion on other people because that's bullshit you know it's a it's down the confidence thing again it, it's you know, it's a matter of your personal confidence. I feel more confident with who I am now, and I know I'm ten times more confident than I was living as my old self. You know, you can twist my words any way you want to, but at the end of the day, I am here to live my life the way I need to live my life. End of. You know? And, again, I apologize you feel that way, and I apologize that you it didn't work out for you. But then why are you watching this channel? That's all I have to say. Anyway, um, stay tuned for the other people's videos um, throughout the week. And um, if you have any questions, send them to transyouthchannel at gmail.com. Um, if you would like to audition for a spot in Trans Youth Channel, please contact Sammy or Kit. Um, the requirements are you need to have a YouTube channel that you have been regularly posting videos and that you have a little bit of a following just to know just so that we know that you are actually going to make videos every single week that is important to us um, so if you're going to make videos every single week make sure you have a YouTube channel that you've been posting to regularly um, and be a transgendered youth and yeah, just send your application with your channel, a link to your channel and who you are and why you want to be in the channel and all that junk and they'll deal with it. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, leave your comments below, like this video, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to know any more information about us or me, you can always go to my personal channel, which is XO question mark OX. And I will speak to you all next time. Bye.